So the first GameCube that we're going to fix today, I bought it from eBay. It said not working for parts. So let's put a disc in, see what happens. A whole lot of... What the? An error has occurred. Turn the power off and check Nintendo GameCube instruction booklet for further instructions. Yeah, I'll show you instructions. Fix you. Yeah. Take that. And that. That'll teach you. Apparently the whole problem was the, uh, need a little bit of adjustment, I believe. It's a, uh, the voltage regulator, probably. Just need a little bit of adjustment with a really tiny, uh, flip head screwdriver. Alright, let's turn the sucker on and see what happens. Oh good, it works. As you can tell, it works now. It's about the game's... Ah. It's alright. It's not that shitty. I beat it a few times, just to show that the system works now. No, I'm not hitting start. I'm not playing the game. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Just showing that it works. I just noticed the eye is blinking. Now for our second GameCube. The power button is stuck because apparently somebody tried to jab it with a steak knife or something. And the eject button is just like sticking. People probably drop pop and shit maybe not shit but mostly pop so we'll use our new good old game bit to take the sucker apart we're just taking the cover off don't need to worry about the base too much because everything else works now for the button there's two little tags we just gotta squeeze top and bottom above the little square there flathead screwdriver works Take, you know, do one side at a time and then just eventually just pops it right out. See how it's all jagged there? Now for the eject button. Apparently that was all full of pop and crap, whatever was the hell is in there, because it was all sticky. You know, last time I checked, the GameCube is not a coaster. For some people. Hmm? Even though it's got a nice round, you know, display there. Yeah, I'll clean that with some... Good old Lysol wipes there. Get all the stickiness out. Who knows what else was in there. Apparently it was really crappy brown. It's disgusting. Probably some cheap cola there. No name brand. Or some Dr. Pib or something. Take all the stickiness out. Off the little button there. Why do people do that? It's beyond me. You don't keep drinks or anything around your game systems. Because then you got to do this after and clean them all up and get all the stickiness off. Let's try it. There you go. That's a lot better. Now the power button is a bit more of a pain in the butt. I don't know why I'm cleaning it before I'm doing the next operation there, but... Apparently sanding it down is the way to go. we will make it nice and smooth. And I'll jag it anymore. And look at that. It'll just come, pop right in. Look at that, nice and smooth, good action. Perfect. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe.